Welcome to our e-learning video on arms control. Arms control is the process of limiting the production, possession, and use of weapons, particularly weapons of mass destruction, WMDs, such as nuclear, chemical, and biological weapons. The goal of arms control is to reduce the risk of war and to promote international security and stability. Arms control agreements are typically negotiated between countries, and they can take many forms. Some agreements limit the number of weapons that a country can possess, while others prohibit the development or production of certain types of weapons. One of the most famous arms control agreements is the Treaty on the Non-Proliferation of Nuclear Weapons, NPT, which was signed in 1968. The NPT aims to prevent the spread of nuclear weapons and to promote the peaceful use of nuclear energy. As of today, 191 countries have joined the treaty. Another example of arms control agreement is the Chemical Weapons Convention, CWC, which prohibits the production, possession, and use of chemical weapons. The CWC was adopted in 1993 and as of today, 192 countries have ratified the treaty. In conclusion, arms control is the process of limiting the production, possession, and use of weapons, particularly weapons of mass destruction, WMDs, such as nuclear, chemical, and biological weapons. The goal of arms control is to reduce the risk of war and to promote international security and stability. The Treaty on the Non-Proliferation of Nuclear Weapons, NPT, and the Chemical Weapons Convention, CWC, are examples of arms control agreements, which have been ratified by many countries. Thank you for watching our e-learning video on arms control. We hope you have a better understanding of this important concept and its role in promoting international security and stability.